Okay guys, I was checking out some vids. Um, I got this idea from, uh, he just put out a new vid, Run For Your Life 24 times. Uh, he took apart his uh, cabinet lock here and he gave me the idea on how to bypass it. I never even really thought of it before until I saw the back half of it. Uh, it is easy to pick. He picked it the normal way and I actually have a vid picking it normal way but uh, if you ain't got the tools and you lose one of your keys, uh, you can get it on a paper clip here. Okay, what you do is just uh, take your paper clip and you can stick it in either side. I know this side would have the glass on it and uh, you'd, you'd have to do it this side of the glass, but it's not affixed to anything and I'm kind of like fumbling it around. If it was affixed to something, like, it would be a lot easier. So I'm just going to go on this side. And get in there, and there's a little spring clip right there that catches on these locks. As all you do is lift that spring up, and it slides off. Okay. And oh, just had it. There you go. Like I said, if it was affixed to a cabinet, it'd be a lot easier. But here we go. There it is. There you go. There it is off. Uh, paper clip. Yeah, you could jam it in either side. You might have to push it just a hair to get that, you know, because uh, push it just a hair to get off that saw blade and then slide it. But uh, there you go. That idea came from. Uh, run for your life 24 times and the lock is right back on and check out some of his vids they're pretty good on YouTube oh, and here's the key just to show you that it does work with the key and still does and uh, there you go see you later have fun